everyone, Mr. Tech here, and this is the unboxing of Redmi Y2. So, first of all, opening up the box, you will find the device itself. So, let's skip this device to the side and let's check out some box contents. So, there is a package, open it up, you will find the documentations and some paper guide. And there is a plastic transparent case for the device. So, after that, you will find a USB cable for data syncing and charging and there was a travel adapter so the rating is 5 volt 2 ampere and the last you will find the sim ejector tool so now let's pull all the plastics off so by the time i boot this device and set this up let me tell you the specifications of this device so the redmi y2 is powered by snapdragon 625 processor which is octa core processor and clocked at 2.0 gigahertz it has 5.99 inch 18 inch to 9 aspect ratio hd plus display it has 3 gb of ram 32 gb of internal storage it has 3080 mAh battery, it has 12 plus 5 megapixel dual rear camera with single tone LED flash and 16 megapixel of front camera with LED flash. It has fence unlock as well as the fingerprint unlock. So this device is runs on MIUI 9.5 and comes with Android 8.0 out of the box. So now on the left of this device you will find the SIM tray. On the top you will find the IR blaster, the 3.5mm headphone jack and the secondary noise cancellation microphone. On, so on the bottom you will find the microphone as well as the USB charging socket and the speaker. So on the right of this device you will find the power lock and lock button and the volume up and down button. So on the back of this device you will find the dual 12 plus 5 megapixel of camera with a single tone LED flash as well as a fingerprint reader and below that you will find the MI logo. So now after all that let's talk about the display. So it has 5.99 inch HD plus display which has the 18 to 9 aspect ratio. So uh, it seems to look like that the display quality is not that great but to be honest in real life this screen looks really awesome and the colors pop out very well and there is no issue with the screen while you tilt or something like that. So for the display sector the display is pretty good for the price tag. So after that let's talk about the cameras. So on the rear you will get 12 plus 5 megapixel of camera with a single tone LED flash. On the front you will get AI powered 16 megapixel camera and there is a flash is also available. So the pictures taken in daylight are looking really awesome to be price tag and the front cameras are really special because the portrait modes are also available so you can click the portrait mode from the front camera too. So in this camera you will get the stabilization mode. So this is the stabilization video, you must need to check this out because the stabilization is pretty good as for my choice. So let me know in the comments that how was the picture quality and the stabilization. So guys thank you so much for watching this video, hope you liked it. If you did make sure to give this video a thumbs up, do share and comment and also subscribe Mr. Tech because you will get those kind of videos every week. So I am signing out, have a nice day.